running around doing his. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I, I, I'm always happy when H2K wins because I know that like Batman actually puts in a lot of work when it comes to the game. Like he's actually actively practicing like constantly, whether it's like whether it's in person or he's just like at home like learning he's, about stuff. He is dedicated, no! definitely, definitely. absolutely dedicated. Mm -hmm. But on the flip side, uh, Varun actually uh, also very dedicated to learning just like a lot of like Wii Fit specific tech and stuff like that. Yeah. And definitely like Wii Fit specific like counterplay to uh, certain like characters. Does he, he, he never switches off at all. He's just always beat the trainer. Uh, can you play anybody else? Yeah, you can play uh, Peach Blast Daisy, Daisy or Bayonetta. Okay. Yeah, but definitely when you're like this deep into the bracket and you want to like really risk it with uh, an untrained character in an untrained matchup, it might be a little bit difficult. But it might work in, in uh, Brune's favor, but it can be very scary. Yeah. I think this is the matchup they had last time when they were playing. It was... Uh... Uh, HK has been sticking with, uh, with Rob. Yeah, a lot of pressure right there. Varun actually did an up smash just out of shield, helping uh, HK with jump. But let's see the ledge trap. This is so important. In these situations, when you're fighting against Varun, you have to be so ready to play against his ledge play. Yeah. Here it is. Okay, Varun with the pressure now. Ah! Wow. Oh, the chase there. Yeah, I'm actually surprised HK didn't die right there, too. The heavy boy. Oh. Oh, that's a good angle too for Varun. Nope. Yeah, got him on that one. Yeah, when you have deep breathing, you have to just like be aware of like the out of shield options right there. And you know like Varun has like planned that, right? F kill on yeah. shield base. Like, Varun doesn't do anything on accident. No, definitely not. Ooh. But there he goes, answers right back. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, we were A lot of us were talking like downstairs about uh, Rob up kill into up air. It's so hard to DI that move. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like Rob pretty much has all the answer to like mix up since you pop straight up. So would you say that Rob's counter to, uh, to Weaver Trainer? Uh, I, w I wouldn't say so completely. Rob is just like too good of a character, right? Solid, has tools for everything, right? Yeah. So, so long as you know the proper counterplay, it can be very good. But Varun actually playing such a good game right now. If you don't know the matchup, like if you don't know the Varun matchup, you're going to lose against Varun. Oh, nice spot dodge. Mm -hmm. Good stuff. The pressure right here for Varun. Oh, oh gosh. <gasps> His coverage on the ledge is just... On fire right now. Yeah. Oh, okay. Nice. Okay. The air dodge. Oh, cut the angle. Yeah, and that, that's like one of the things where you play against Varun, you kind of know like, what to expect. That, that's something that we've seen like last week and also like a couple weeks beforehand is that angle for the header. Pretty sharp. Mm. There oh, we go, Varun. Quick, 94 points. Mm -hmm. 96 actually. Ah. There it goes, got him off the ledge, but Ooh. not quite enough. Yeah, now you gotta play the game against Varun. Wow, what Ooh. a catch. Still not dead though. Yeah. Oh, okay, I, I see exactly what uh, A3K was going for. Oh, great match. Varun, crazy with the match too. Nice tech roll in too. Like That, that avoided so many situations. Yeah. He's gotta finish it soon though. Oh, try to catch the double jump. Not quick enough though. <laughs> Uh, I, I see exactly what HDK was going for. A lot of people really like trying to like get off the platform, and the platform's kind of sticky, so you can get uh, blown up by that. No! Wow. Right through it. That was a sick parry. That timing was sick. Yeah, that, that was actually just like, exceptional patience right there from Varun. Like, even starting from the second stock almost, it felt like uh, he had a good idea of exactly what HDK wanted and stayed yeah. away from the zones. Yeah, I mean, he probably learned a lot from last time. Oh, for sure, for sure. You think he's going to stay with Rob or he's going to go? Uh, yep. Yeah, probably stay with Rob. Just because Rob has all the tools necessary in order to like beat Wii Fit. It just, it's just a matter of like whether Ace Decay is comfortable fighting on the ledge against Varun. And if you let Varun have that uh, mix-ups on the ledge, it makes it so much harder to really finish out his stop. Okay. Yeah. The pressure right here from Varun. Actually, just like Ooh. the aggression from Varun. Yeah. Absolutely missing. Nice little, nice little duel we got going on. Yeah, they're it's scrapping. Uh huh. They're definitely boxing with each other. And it's it's always fun to see like we fit actually use grounded normals a lot more. Wow. These up smashes are so like out of nowhere. Yeah, he's paid for a few of the missed ones so far. It's a little bit risky. Ooh. Yeah, the, the air dodge. Thought he could make it back, but not enough. Varun. Just avoiding a lot of these situations too. Nah. Oh, nice <laughs> like. Do you think he did that on purpose? Uh, yeah, most. Yeah, I, I can definitely see it. Okay. Ooh, Ooh. nice. He answers right back. Yeah, that charge on the gyro actually is crazy. Uh, if it's charged like a little bit more, it can't kill. 
earlier than you think. Hmm. I see. I see where we're trying to go from there. All right. Ace K starts the pressure. Nice match out of that situation. Very smart from Varun. Ooh. Oh wow, Ace K so good. Oh dang. Yeah. He's gaming. Yeah. Actually, the pressure on Varun right now. Varun's answering actually really well though. Like a lot of the. Uh, sticky situations where most other people would have died. Uh, Varuna actually staying pretty composed. Ah. Mm -hmm. He's not too far down. He's on a little disadvantage right now, but uh, he's not too far down. So yeah. Could... Oh, some more damage here. The... Oh, that's evened out. Yeah, the soccer ball actually created such a weird interaction with road arms there. Oh, no. Ooh. Oh, oh. <gasps> went for it, paid for it, but not quite off. Yeah. Smart, smart to go for it if you're H2K just because without deep breathing it is a lot less safe. Just a matter of spacing. Oh, no punish, actually. Oh, yeah, that was gonna be a grab off that. <laughs> nice. H2K in the air. Oh, oh, right over him. Yeah, I'm actually surprised to see Varun actually just land straight like that. H2K really thirsty for the kill. It's definitely gonna be fishing for those dust matches. Okay, he's gonna pressure up on H2K. <gasps> No. <laughs> Not high enough in order to do those gyro play combos. Mmm. So aware. Up air. Ah, okay. I really don't think Varun has like made one mistake this entire game. Yeah, it, he has uh, like full control of his vehicle. It doesn't feel like Varun is just like panicking at all too. Nice roll away from the situation. Okay, that's data collected for Varun. Four throw. Pick up. Oh no, this might be out. No, it's not quiet. Yeah. That deep breathing. Yeah, and, and like decent DI too. Uh, yeah, these, these road arms are definitely on purpose. Varun wanted that ball. Oh. He wanted to hit it back. Oh, we got some very bottom corner. Yeah. That was such a good angle. Jeez, Varun. Yeah. Wow. Varun's just on it right now. <laughs> He is. He's on it. He's playing like a monster. Like, like you said earlier, just kind of like no mistakes. No. Especially in those like scrappy situations too. He It feels like he's just been kind of like waiting to see like what Aster K really wants and then just choosing the option to beat it out completely. I think it's just going to come down to more because like Aster K is not making very many mistakes either. Yeah, it, it doesn't, just it doesn't come doesn't down to experience like with, the with your character. No. Yeah. Like... Uh, <laughs> It's it's much easier for Varun to like lab against a more popular character like Rob, right? Yeah. Than it is for HDK to prepare for a refit trainer. Yeah, and then since it's a uh, uh, Varun specialized in one character, but HDK is, spe is specialized in a couple characters. Yeah, yeah, that's true too. So the extra time that he spends on you know playing uh, other people, he doesn't get it playing Rob. No, definitely, that's definitely true. Okay, right now HDK answering really strong. Nice. Nice, I like the gyro too right there. Varun with a great roll in. Nice. I like the soccer ball interaction. <laughs> oh, the, the volleyball, whatever it is. That plus gyro on the screen, it just like makes things so crazy. Oh, uh, that's it again. I would say, is it a soccer ball or volleyball? It is a soccer ball, yes. Ay, that was so close. Ah. Oof, yeah, that's a, that's a, you know, it, I'll take it back. There is a couple mistakes that he's made. He's, he's gone for those, the up smashes, and then he gets immediately, you know, short hop back aired. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, which, which sent him off two or three times already, so. Okay, nice catch. Oh, wait for the air dodge, but no, try to go for a back air instead. Ah, I like the jump right there too. H2K setting up the pressure, but Varun snipes out a, a empty hop right there from H2K. Those air to airs are so important in these uh, in these matchups. Okay, no double okay, jump. Here. Oh, oh that's wow, it. that's gonna be rough to recover from. Yeah, yeah easy, easy clap off the edge. Mm -hmm. But 54 points down, not too bad. Oh, yeah. Now it's oh, terrible. Oh, oh goodness. The, That's like four hits. The string, oh, the parry, the f pills. I should have knocked on wood on that one. <laughs> yeah. Definitely within the realms of possibility for HBK, though. Uh, well practiced with the gyro combos. It seems like Varun has been just like catching the gyro in most, situa uh, most situations, and it's really throwing HBK off. Okay. Mm. Oh. Got hit by the sun. Yeah. Powerful thing that is. <laughs> oh, all right. Getting something started. Ace to K. Try to go for a whiff punish, but Varun not letting it happen. Hmm. Yeah, that happens all the time. Full hop there. You still got time to do a landing aerial too. Catches a lot of people off guard. 
Oh no, no that might no. be it. Uh... Alright. Interesting attempt right there for Rune to get a back air, but this is it. Alright, got him there. Yeah, now 96% on HPK. I mean, he's not in the big force. I'll do it this time. Oh. Wow. That's a little dangerous. Mm -hmm. Still manages to find 45% unanswered. Yeah, get him on combo on the edge and you can get a quick down spike, but there it goes. Wait, no, no, still alive. no, not yet. Yeah, I like going high right here too for H2K because Brune's been doing such a good job of sniping H2K. You have to stay high. You're going to have to deal with this uh, deep breathing for now, but if you can stay alive, you can definitely make it happen. Playing nice defensively, so get from distance. Yeah. For it to go away. Oh. Ooh. Yeah, a little bit scary right there too with that landing. Oh, oh no, the, the the free uh the free ball bouncing around the stage. Oh, what a great landing in there too, catching Rune. Yeah, he's at he, he's at kill percentage if you can spike him. Oh, 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 oh no, it, yeah. Rune! Wall jump? Oh, oh my god. Oh no. I thought he would have gone for the, the down uh down spike for sure. Yeah, I, I thought so also. Okay, double jump use. H2K. Barely hanging on, 200%. Oh, but he gets it! That was so smart! Oh! Alright, putting one game on the board, we'd like to see it. Yeah, did you see that? He actually ran up and, and caught the gyro while doing the rising up air. Kind of calling out Varun doing an aggressive option, like maybe an aggressive jump in or something like that, just to really punish, like, if H2K wanted to grab the gyro, I'm just, he was going to say, yeah, yeah, you can pick it up, but I'm going to put that pressure on you. Yeah. That was smart. Yeah, that was great. Oh, gosh. Okay. Game number four, a lot, a lot more scary for H2K though now, right? This is Rune's counter pick. Uh, you're in a much smaller stage, so you can't just like slow the pace of the match. But hey, you might not need it. Yeah, he's not gonna let him, not gonna let him set up and get his his gyros on. But his his gyro has been a lot more effective than his lasers. Uh, it seems to be every time he puts a laser out, he gets um, counted with the, uh, trades with the ball. Yeah, or sun salutation, right? Yeah. So it's it might not be too that be much to a disadvantage. I think it's probably gonna be more on like the how he feels after getting that game. Yeah. Like he is an emotional player, and you know, if he starts getting frustrated, he might do worse. Yeah. But since he finally got one on Varun, um, he might kick it up a notch. Okay. Great jump right there from Varun. Held on, and also the header smart to avoid the rotor arms. Oh. Wow, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, there he goes, right there. Okay, he landed one, there he goes. Yeah, that, that, that's good. That's uh, definitely a good sign for H2K right there. Maroon, oh, the Barry. Yeah, now, hard situation for H2K to make it back. Of course, you're gonna go high against Maroon. No, makes it back to the ledge. Wow. All right, still. Ledge? <laughs> yeah, still oh, oh, no, <laughs> the double. Yeah, that's, that's so good. The, the catch on the double jump, right? I think I, there, uh, Hype should have uh, been uh, focusing on his laser because he did the first time, got knocked away the first time, then he tried to do it the second time. He should have yeah. focused more on dodging. On dodging. That, that's definitely one of those like things where it's just like, yeah, you play against enough robs, you know they want a laser Oof. when they're coming back. Oh, wow. Great uh, answer right there for H2K. Varun really wanted that down air. Oh, and he stopped the uh, deep breathing. Nice. Yeah, this is this is a good situation. Mmm, Gyro so smart. If had he thrown out the sun salutation, it would have just been eaten by Gyro. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. Okay. Great. Oh, but he got the tech. Oh, so he got the tech, too. Mm -hmm. Both of these, both these guys are playing so well. Yeah. <laughs> Their situational awareness is at an all-time high. Oh. All right. I think uh, H3, H3 remembered who he was playing. Yeah. Oh. oh. He got hula hooped. Oh, he got neutral aired. Yeah, 161 now, Varun. Oh, uh, goodness. Got, oh, no. Yeah, no air dodge available for Varun, actually, but still managed to find his way back. F yeah, uh, good job, Varun. Yeah. Oh, man, those F tilts have been, uh, have been uh, H3K's nightmare this game. Mm -hmm. He's on, out on that one, yeah. He let out the shield a little too early. Mm -hmm. Just one of those situations where it's just like, yeah, he's not going to do it, and he <laughs> H2K did it anyway. Yeah. Yeah, one of the few times where, like, uh, H2K's, like, thirst for a kill actually really worked out well. Oh, what is... Oh, no, really? Oh, that was it? Did, <laughs> Look at H2K's. Did H2K, like, try to fare in that situation or something? Or try to do a nair? He definitely started something 